What's going on guys, Renegade here with Alexis as usual. Uh, so it's about 2.30 a.m. and we're headed to Dallas, Texas to pick my sister up. It's gonna be a long, brutal trip. We gotta be back by Tuesday morning. So we're gonna try to make this happen. Got a few stops along the way. St. Louis, maybe Memphis. Wherever the highway takes us, there's like three routes to get there. So we'll just plug it in our GPS and see how we're going to get there and on our way home. So stay tuned for some footage. been here one other time if you ever passing through Missouri check it out it's like a one-stop shop got pretty good food and anything you're looking for gifts or collectible items uh, stuff for your home got a smoke shop we're actually gonna park and go outside it's pretty chaotic right now that spot right there. Well, All right, I'm taking you guys inside. All right, check this shit out, guys. Got the bone shaker here. It's literally just. Fireworks on fireworks. Got that guerrilla warfare. <laughs> Just sell this like all year round. So if you want to get your Fourth of July shopping done early, you gotta check this place out. Got the Weeping Willow. Tweaked out. That's a trippy like box, look at that. I'm not huge into fireworks, but hey. So this is just a fireworks section. Let's go check out the rest of the store. The other section of the store. Got like some knickknacks and all the decor. It's not a bad looking setup.
of stuff ain't going into it. One stop shop, literally. This is what we all came for. Odd Sauce Collection. They got the spontaneous combustion. You got to ask for that shit. <laughs> sign your name on it. Yeah, you got to sign the light. Bad ass kick it. Whatever you need to get fucked up. That shit look like. It'll be some damage. Frostbite hot sauce. That's pretty much it. One stop shop. Got a lot to choose from here. Should we get back on the road? Yes. All right. All right, what's going on, guys? So we're here in Arkansas, uh, near Marion, <clears throat> on our way to Memphis, Tennessee. Stopped at a uh, gas station. Not even sure what the fuck this is. Um, found some pretty dope flavors of Mini Maid. Let me know if you guys ever seen these before. I might be. But got a watermelon punch, fruit punch, berry punch, and kiwi strawberry. Let me know in the comments if you've tried any of these. This is new to me. And it may come in with the hips. So just ate at this chow time place. That was pretty decent. Uh, 30 bucks for two people, not bad. All you can eat, Chinese and American buffet. You guys should check it out. It's called Chow Time in Memphis, Tennessee. What'd you think? It was good. It was very good. What Worth your, it. What was your favorite part of it? Garlic bread. Garlic bread. I love garlic bread. They had the best garlic bread I ever had. I'm going to say the, that beef on the Chinese buffet. Okay, that was really good too. It I had don't some think type I of soy a... sauce and pepper on it yeah. or something like that. Got to try that shit if you come here. I didn't eat a single bad thing. Yeah, it was pretty good. And I'm very picky. Worth the price. Yeah. All right, let's get on the road. We are headed six hours that way to texas all right so here we are in dallas how long has it been 14 hours a long time, a long time. too long yeah the wave was well worth it look at that skyline St. Louis, eating some Popeyes. They all had a chicken sandwiches, so I had to settle for tenders, but check out that bad boy right there. Here's the St. Louis Arch. It's my first. 
first time seeing it up this close. Very cool. It's impressive. We gotta get back home to Milwaukee, otherwise we take you guys up top to see the city, but uh, we'll pick the video up over in downtown, show you guys downtown St. Louis. in traffic right now. Check that out. I've never seen a golf cart. They drunk as hell too. Got a golf cart going up and down the street. We'll just follow them. St. Louis so dingy. That's not like a diss to anybody that lives in St. Louis, but it's kind of dingy here, y'all. It's a little bit Y'all got some some views, don't get me wrong, but and that's coming from a dude from Milwaukee, like probably the dingiest city of all, but take a push broom or something up and down the street. Bush was it? Bush. Bush factory. Got the Bush Stadium there. St. Louis Cardinals. You hear me got like a hundred buses on this block. But it's got its own vibe here. Chicago feels like Chicago. Dallas feels like Dallas. St. Louis feels like its own, you know. I don't get vibes of another city, it's just unique in its own way. That's what's cool about it, I guess. with the long traffic lights. Just as they say, green. 